my dad donated a bunch of stockings to the classroom, so he kind of adopted our classroom, and that got me thinking. Um, I no longer work there, but I wanted to be able to give back to them. Um, so we decided on belly bags. Um, my mom, always, she would always say, um, full belly, hard head, stinky feet. And so that means a lot if you break it all down. So with bags, oh, you're okay. Um, it's a bag, we're gonna use pillowcases, um, full of food that can last them while they're on their Christmas vacation. So kind of like a St. Nick thing, you know, food and, and fun stuff. So we decided it'd be a lot of fun to be able to donate back to the community and especially kids. A lot of them rely on adults to help them. So uh, what's it like to, to see somebody uh, like uh, Danielle uh, step up and, and volunteer to do this? And what is the need for some of these items for children over the holidays? What Danielle has done with stepping up with this name of Belly Bags has really touched the heartstrings of a lot of people. She is reaching out to a lot of community members with this. She will reach 138 Head Start children. Uh, with that, there's 130 families that are going to have that extra snack and food for the children. The children are off for 10 days over that holiday between Christmas and New Year. So as they are in their homes at that time, they'll be able to have that extra food and snack because it puts a hardship on some of the families with having no, you know, with having all kids home from school in those 10 days. So this will give that extra help to those 130 families. I learned so many things. Um, I learned that it's not always what it looks like. Um, there are kids that need help, and there are families that are in need. And there are also kids that don't receive a lot for Christmas. And it's important to help them appreciate uh, people helping, but also for them to enjoy the holidays. And um, from working at Operation New View, Seeing all of these kids, um, their, their little hearts are just made of gold and they're trying their best and I would like to see them succeed and become beautiful little souls and human beings and so I would like to help them, they have my heart forever.